friends, it's me. And today we're checking out some cool houses on TikTok. And visual line means lisp. This came up on my free page the other day. I cannot believe there is this glass box just hanging off the side of a cliff in the middle of nowhere. Somebody hiked this mountain and was like, yeah, you know what? This is where I want to wake up every day the rest of my life. I made a glass box bedroom just hanging off a cliff. No, you know what? You're doing it wrong. You know when you like lay down in bed, you close your eyes and then you're just like, Whoa! because it feels like you were falling? Or is that just me? But like, imagine putting the bed in the corner, turning to your side, and then it'll like actually feel like you're falling. Or just make the bottom glass and then sleep on the floor. How terrifying would that be? As beautiful as it is scary. One strike of lightning is all it's gonna take. From being cozy in bed to taking a whole lot of fall damage. Okay, but check this one out. This one's a glass box, but in the water. It's like a running river. Okay, I think I like this much better. Like, the water can't get me. But also, you get to see the water, like, running through. And it's not an ocean. I don't like oceans. It's a river. It feels safer. And then a little table to have breakfast. Okay, but where's the rest of the house? Is it literally just, like, a sunroom where you sleep? Nah, there's no curtains on the roof. First of all, there's no privacy. Second of all, this is for them early rising folks. The ones who like to wake up at the butt crack of dawn. The second the light rays hit their eyeballs, they are up and at it, ready for a productive day. See, I can't do that. Okay, we've seen a lot of cool houses, but I have never seen an underwater house. How do you live underwater? Like, this house is completely submerged underwater. I know she probably gotta swim to the surface, take a <gasps> big old deep breath before she dives back down to film each clip of this. Oh, of course this is in Dubai. In Dubai, they have like this incredibly deep pool, but this one is like a house underwater. How is she doing all of this? Playing piano, heating up some food, dancing on the table. That's crazy how long some people people can hold their breath for and actually do things while they hold their breath. <laughs> Their kitchen island opens up. There is a slide. That's a crazy place to put a slide. Like, imagine the escape. The ops come banging on your door, and you're standing at the fridge, shoveling shredded mozzarella into your mouth, and realize you gotta go. We gotta dip. That's why we installed this escape slide. Takes you to the basement. Or maybe that's where they keep naughty children. There's no way to get back up, climbing up the slide. Okay, that would actually be terrifying. Like, oh, Billy got a B minus in math? You're gonna go down the naughty slide. Go, you have this in your house? This is not YouTube HQ? And everybody gets a huge stuffed animal to snuggle with while they watch a movie? Just your movie room is bigger than most people's house. I'm sorry, you live in this? Who are your parents? Tony Stark? You know, there's Rich and then there's this. Okay, yeah, see, I knew it. Her parents own the Avengers. They literally got like life-size replicas. Oh, look at this elevator. The lights? It looks like a museum. So he's a Star Wars fan and this is his house. Oh, this is the top floor. Look at that view. The house is not very practical. It's like, where's the kitchen? Where's the bathroom? Where's the bedroom? Oh, we don't have a kitchen, but we have a music room. And a pool? What? You know, there's gotta be like something on every floor. Bro has an entire skyscraper to himself. Calls it a house. There's the spa room. Okay, what does this house not have? My mind is literally blown. Like I've never seen a house this crazy. Ways to get in my bed. Oh, I've seen her bed before. She literally slides to get out of bed. How many times have you hit your head on that ceiling? It seems a little low. Like, yeah, it'd be nice to have your bed in like this cozy little corner, but don't you feel like a little claustrophobic? Where do you keep your phone and your water at night? I feel like you toss and turn a little too much, you're gonna slide right off. Sleep and slide. This is probably every little kid's dream. Having a themed bedroom of their favorite show, their favorite character. So her dad made her an aerial little mermaid themed bedroom. But wait, there's a skylight in the room. Oh, how I love skylights so much. Did a sticker of aerial, added some bubbles. Okay, these are cool. Hammer some nails and put these like plastic capsules all over. I feel like there should be a better way to hang these up. I would glue them. I wouldn't hammer them down. Okay, that's cool. And it looks like there's just like bubbles everywhere. But it's like, that house gonna shake a little bit. That thunder gonna hit a little too hard. You're gonna have a little mini heart attack when those fall on you in the middle of the night. Oh, this is the bathroom. Hey, if you did this for the bathroom, what'd you do for her bedroom? You know, I thought life just wasn't fair. Some parents just love their kids more. Okay, that's actually really pretty. Now, every time she goes to the toilet, she can just look up at the skylight and Little Mermaid will be there watching you pee. I don't know how I feel about that. It's a normal house on the inside. Okay, what about the outside? Whoa, it's a koi pond. But like, look at the rest of the backyard. Wow, y'all splurged on this black backyard. Backyard, I can't speak today. Speech is very difficult for me. Oh, y'all got a fire pit, and then the pond goes all the way around. Y'all got lily pads. 
Oh, this is gorgeous. This is like right up my alleyway. I would die to have a backyard like this. But I live in the middle of the desert. I don't know if you can have a koi pond in 120 degree weather. Walk outside, they'd be fish and chips. Simply too hot. Your house is so fun. I mean, that doesn't look like a very normal house to me. You already have at least one secret doorway. It's not even a secret room. It leads to a whole secret section of the house. It's a slide. So you can go down the slide instead of using the stairs. And then it leads to a secret arcade room. Okay, this is like every kid's dream. Is this what it's like to have parents who love you? I gotta stop making these jokes. My mom watching my videos. It just keeps going on and on. It's like a whole secret wing in this house. That is a truck with the blue Blankets in the back. It's like going through a drive-by movie. Like, you know the outdoor ones? And then you sit and watch in the back of your lover's truck. I've never been to one of those, but I've seen it in the movies. This is literally such a dream. To top it all off, the fake grass indoors. I am nuts for fake grass indoors. It has to be inside the house. It makes it so much cooler. Oh, but my dogs would be pissing on it. Yeah, no, that's not gonna work. You know, everybody watching these are like, oh my God, your house is so cool, it's so fun. And these kids just be sitting in their bed, just scrolling on TikTok like, it's all right. Like, you don't use the cool things as much as you think you will. Oh, I know that's the secret book. That unlocks a hidden door. Oh, does the bottom part come out too? Yeah, pull it open. Oh, it lifts up. Wait, so they're not actually real books? Are the other ones real books? That's like a wood plank. They have no dimension. No pages. A library for the illiterate. There's nothing to read. Oh, it leads to a hidden staircase. Where does that lead to? I ain't see a part two, so we'll guess we'll never know. This is literally a witch house. This is straight out of Disney. The OG Snow White. Didn't she scrub the floors and something like that? Look at the gate. It's so silly looking. What's up? What are you doing? Can I see inside? <sighs> You got a few um, minutes? I actually do have a few minutes. Would you mind? You're telling like me that's house? his house? Did you have to pay off a witch to get this place? or? In 1998, yes, I got rid of her. She was the second owner. <laughs> <laughs> Across the moat we go. I'm already gonna say a crazy witch lady needs to live in this house. There's no way this is his house. Bro looks like he rents it out on Airbnb. Oh, so, this is incredible. Wait, wait, wait. First of all, there's a fireplace right Whoa. here. It's, it's cool. As we say, it's cold as a witch is whatever. You know what I mean? <laughs> Even the insane. inside is cool. It's like full of like... Found like it literally I've looks like a Disney princess's, princess's house. And you know, their poor house before they move into the palace. Oh my god, your kitchen. <gasps> your kitchen is great. Wow. If you like organic cool tiles. This is man. incredible. So like everything about uh, this house is just so this fun. Hang out. We meaning like you know, they really put some spirit. thought <laughs> into building this thing, so like the architecture, the like bathrooms, like wild ride. I love the shapes of the hallways. I, These are so fun. What the heck? And this is kind of where it all happens, supposedly. It's the master suite. Yeah, I would love my villain origin story to start in this house. I love bathtubs. So you get ready every day in this bathroom. Yeah. That blows my mind. You wanna come outside for a second? The pool also. The tile installation like <gasps> Let me see that pool, the tile. It's like a custom tile job. I know they hand laid that tile. This is gorgeous. I don't know if I would want to live here, but just like straight out of a Disney movie. I always wanted to do something like this, like a built-in doggy gate. My doggy gates are just so big and bulky and always in the way. This one literally pulls out like a drawer. Okay, this is absolutely genius. I want to show them this video when I build a house. Everybody has that one thing in their house that everybody thinks is so cool. Could be a hidden cabinet. Oh, it's a little movie, movie room. room. Gadget. But oh, ours. That? Where does this tunnel this? lead to? I feel like illegal activity goes on behind there. What is this? Imagine going down in your basement. Like you have this long light up hallway. Your parents say you can never go down there. Like it either leads to like a club or a dungeon. That's it. It's kind of creepy. Okay, this is spoiled to the next level. You know, I thought the little arcade and movie room was every kid's dream. No, it just keeps getting better and better. They have an entire rock climbing wall. Not even like a 10 foot one. This is like 30 feet. You actually get a good climb. And then when you're done, just like let go and then fall into the ball pit. Or if you have very weak arm muscles, you can just sit on the swing and then swing over the ball pit. And then when you feel like ending it all, just jump into the ball pit. I meant ending the swing session. Whoa! 
you can literally slide down there. And it's like one of those LED light up slides. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? I don't know if I went through like a roller coaster or like a slide or I, I saw a video on it. I, I don't know. I have so many false memories. I think it was a TikTok. Now, usually a slide is dark, but like this slide was like all lit up. This is such a dream. You know, even as an adult watching this, I want this. I feel like I would have been a much nicer person if I grew up with this. Or maybe I'd just be spoiled. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and the face. Comment below, what was the coolest thing in this video? And make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click. And I just released some new merch. We got hoodies, shirts, tank tops at ogwolfpack.com. I'll link it below. And subscribe to the Wolfpack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.